There we go. The very worst for the bourgeoisie. <laughs> Thank you for that, Hunter. That's also... <laughs> That's the first thing that anybody listening on YouTube is going to hear. <laughs> That's what I'm here for. Okay, time to continue. I will say, Doom 3, so far not my favorite Doom. I've heard that a lot of people dislike Doom 3. Because it takes away from, like, the action, the fast-paced action to become a more horror thing, and it's not very scary. Yeah. But... I like the way they went with it, but at the same time, it was just... What the? We were given two 2D first-person shooters, and then we were given this, and this was significantly worse. Ow, I got hit. They also nerfed the shotgun. Yeah. Mainly by giving it so much spread that it's, like, obnoxious. It's just, like, not possible to really hit anything. I still use it all the time. Ammo's abundant. Well, not only... Not only that, but... Just... Your other options right now, at least for me, are that of a pistol or a machine gun. And I'm not a big fan of either of those. I use the shotgun for, uh, I use the shotgun mainly for, uh, the strong dudes. Like the people with, like, uh, one, the strong dudes, and two, the people with the shotguns or anything like that. Because those guys, because just like the original Doom, those guys are your biggest threat, I swear! Anything that doesn't use a projectile. Oh my god. Hey, there's a... There's an obese dude with a wrench. Very effective. Yeah, I already took him out, Hunter. You're not very effective at killing people. I tried my hand at it. Never tried your hand at it? Yeah, unfortunately not. There's, there's a lot of legal, legal paperwork that would have to come before and after, so... I... And probably a lot of time in a hello, room. Hello, is this reaching anyone? Uh, I'm broadcasting on a very low frequency. If you can hear me, I'm not far. Please help me. I've locked myself in storage room C4. Please, if anyone can hear me, please help me. He's in storage room C4. That sounds like a kaboom! I don't know where storage room C4 is. I imagine by the time I get to it, he's going to be dead. No, I can't shoot through that. This rifle. I take back about what I was saying about it. I kind of like it now. Oh yeah, they made a mistake. I have 35 grenades on my person. Oh no. Wait, is this storage room C4? It is not storage room C4. Yeah, I don't know why they gave me so many grenades. You know what I mean? Yeah. Wait a second. Nice, an infinity shot. Uh, Andrew Chin. Audio report regarding the disrespectful treatment of new research staff. September 14th, 2145. As you know, I have gone to considerable effort to recruit my staff researchers for Alpha Labs. Finding team members with the qualifications, let alone the willingness to come to Mars, has not been a trivial task. You know this already. 
but it is necessary that I emphasize why their complaints must be taken seriously. We won't be able to keep our people or recruit new researchers if the harassment continues. No, harassment is exactly the right word. I'm routinely getting reports of UAC security asking inappropriate questions and submitting my staff to unnecessary background checks. I must insist that we be allowed to keep our personal lives private and be left to complete our assignments without further delays. If there is some kind of security threat, I suggest that UAC security look more deeply into their own staff. This is Andrew Chin, end. Okay, I guess I'll finish off reading since I was reading the rest uh, in my head. The door is no longer stuck and we pulled the dent from the side. It'd be a good idea to, in the future, remember your cabinet codes instead of trying to force it open with a wrench. Just for the record, the new code for cabinet 38 is 409. Might be a good idea to write that one down. So then, how's the hunter doing? Hunter? What's up? How is the hunter doing? Not too bad. I am currently looking at the um, Modern Warfare 2 uh, menu script. Yep. Yeah. Uh, would you be down to join me later, though? streaming. Oh! I usually start around 9 o'clock. Oh. And then 11. I see. Hey, look. People that are alive. Move, move, move. You're the only one not there, dude! Okay, seriously. Two things, another video and Walter Connors. Audio log for Walter Connors. The MFS compressor is producing fantastic results. The latest modification I made to the dilation matrix were the real key to the recent breakthrough. All in all, I feel my work on this project has been the catalyst that propelled everything forward. I've also taken a set amount of time each day to make sure that everyone is doing their job, and of course I check all of their data to ensure that no mistakes are made. This is going to be a huge money maker for the company, and quite honestly, without my input and hard work, I'm not sure that we would have gotten this far. But I, I wanted also to thank you for your supervisory role in the project. Working with you is a true honor. Just remember me in the end of the year reports, as I'm certain I deserve a promotion. Uh, Walter out. Hey, honor. Fifty grenades. Ryan. <laughs> I don't use grenades often. Since the dawn of the space Final age, bars, Union Aerospace has been at the forefront of not only developing new technology, but pushing those developments to even more daring extremes. 
With an abundant production of hydrogen fuel, thanks to the Hydrocom, the specialist teams ask the big question. Can we devise a way to store and deliver that fuel to make the dream of deep space research a reality? The answer has been a resounding yes. Under the direction of Dr. Okay. Malcolm Betruger, key UAC scientists have made startling new discoveries in the fields of quantum physics. And with them, they have been able to use the actual space between electrons and protons in a molecule as a storage medium for fuel in our interplanetary antimatter drives. Now, fuel that would once take up half the payload of an interplanetary ship only occupies a fraction of that space. You are looking at the Molecular Fuel Storage Compactor. The MFS compressor is yet another UAC marvel that brings the dream of reaching and colonizing the most distant planets closer to a reality. The UAC has long made safer worlds okay. for everyone, and now they will bring those worlds even closer than you could ever imagine. That is interesting. I am a little bit hurt now. pistol. Hunter, I don't think they're ever going to give me ammo for my pistol again. No, three. I, I'm on Doom 3 and they are not giving me the ammo I so rightfully deserve. I want to head down the alternate path here. See what's beyond here. There's. Oh, wait, there is turning back. I'm assuming this is more secret. Or is it just another way to get to where I was? Well, I got ammo from it. Oh. Let me blow those up. That almost hurt me. Keyword is almost. Hey, Hunter. Hmm. Is it normal for voices in my head to say kill Hunter? Yeah. Or... Da. Just making sure. Hello, James. Hey, old man. <laughs> hey, James. My thing should be purple, so you should know I'm streaming. Yeah, I saw. Indeed, you did. What difficulty should I play Doom 2016 and uh, Doom Eternal? The hardest. The hardest? Why not? Okay. Because I'm bad at games, but that's besides the point. What was that? Did you catch what he said, Hunter? I did not. I almost shot that dude, thinking that he was a, one of the uh, one of the the uh, guys roaming around. You know what I mean? Yeah. I heard you. Uh, I can help you. The lights are all out. I'll lead you through here. Come on, I can't wait. I'm gonna save because this is an escort mission. And I'm assuming knowing Doom, he can actually die. And I, I kinda don't want him dead. Magnetic pulses have knocked out the electrical you know what I mean? in this area. Yeah. Watch out. A big one could knock out our lights. Oh, can't stop. The death animation for what game? That game. 
There's That's one. helpful. No, no, that is terrible. Oh, thank you. Uh, but yeah, James, what was that you said as you were getting further away from the mic? What was that? Uh, I don't know. It was after the Stay close. my reason for not playing the hardest difficulty when you said why not. I see. Ow! Are you kidding me? He died in one hit? Dipping in and out of consciousness right now. It's fine. Dude, just take a take a nap. Electromagnetic. No, I I woke up from a nap. I'd say go back for another nap. No. Then I won't sleep tonight, Hunter. I got a lovely set of mini gun. What if I give you a little bit of, of NyQuil, if There's you get what I'm saying? Nah. I mean, you have... I mean, it could end up being more DayQuil than NyQuil, but... I'm assuming I could, I could give you a good dose of NyQuil. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. No? I'm saying I'm gonna knock him out. By the way, you know how I said knowing Doom, this guy can actually die and they'll let it happen? Hunter? Yeah. You know how I said that, right? Yeah. Yeah, he died in one shot. I cannot hear you. Can you speak louder? No. Why are you so quiet? That was close. You're gonna kill me if I speak louder? Because what? Hunter. His throat is killing it. Speak louder. Oh! Sorry. Hang on. Here comes another. You're not feeling well. You might have to translate quiet, James, for me. Yep. Oh god! Sounds uh, like you might be a bit stuffed too. No. The extra. Just a bit sore. Just a bit sore? Were you screaming? Are you kidding me? Is he guaranteed to die? I searched this room. I searched this room, and there was nothing here. Let me do a quick load. I swear, there was nothing in the room! The entire time that I spent down there, there was nothing. By the way, they gave me Minigun Hunter. That's what you think, but I'm not so convinced. Come on, dude, you need to keep moving forward so I can protect you from the demons. Dude, you need to move faster, dude. I don't know. What what do you what do you plan to do? Like what what what's something you would want to do? Hang on. I am doing fine. 
Hmm. Like, he's gonna play video games, or...? He plans on Beat Saber. Oh, Max Tibby. Okay, where's this demon gonna come from? It's either left or right. Are you kidding me? I don't know. How how am I supposed to kill the demon before it kills him? Is it not possible? I am right here. What? The crash pad is OP. Crash pad's OP? What are you talking about? Yeah. The new thing in port. Is it? There's the exit. So. Is there? There's got to be a way to save them. Oh my god! They're okay. I'm giving up. He's no dead. Do it. Dude, I I I've stood in between him and the demon, so I take hit. I don't even take damage from it. I don't think it's possible. This, this was 103, right? Ah. Uh, okay, Walter Connors. What was the code again? 102. Wow, I missed it by one. Uh, I don't know what ammo the uh, the minigun uses. So I'm gonna be very careful not to waste it, you know what I mean? Yeah. Okay, wait, is there an, is there... No, there's nothing. Is that a body? Cocooned? Dude, that dude likes a kinky! We're talking full encasement, Hunter. I mean, no, that's. <laughs> uh, I. Look, if there can be things in this li in these little crawlways, I don't want to be in them anymore. To be perfectly honest. Yeah, that's fair. What? Oh, that is weird. There's little spider things. Like, they have weird heads. They're not necessarily... Ow! Ow! They pack a wallop! They pack a wallop! Ah! Or maybe they don't pack a wall up and it's just... Okay, why are there so many of them? Do they just endlessly spawn? I need to know that, like, right about now. Please come down, dude. I ain't dealing with this, man. I'll get him. Oh, God. Um. I need to reload. No, meow, meow, meow. Meow, meow. That's his gun. That's what it's called. I thought it's the meow, meow rifle. It's uh, Mr. Meow School's meow school. Call it me. Whatever. Boom! Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh! You think you're a threat? Oh yeah, they gave me pistol ammo again. Wow. Don't 
tell me the shotgun can't kill the little spider things in one hit. It's a shotgun. It better. I'm using it for them. They come up all close like. And what better time? Two. Huh? So you like and save the world, Hunter. It's not bad. I like the character. Character mod. Pretty mm. cool. to get rid of oh I see this is like a waste disposal thing I've played plenty of this or clean up detail this is operations this. coordinator Mark Lamia dated November 1st 2145 I'm filing this report because I am frustrated beyond belief by the level of incompetency I have to deal with here I don't know where HR is getting the new employees, but the last five guys they've sent me were all a bunch of idiots. They can't get any of their work done on time. I constantly have to keep an eye on them. They work slow, they don't follow any of the standard operating procedures, and they can't even remember basic things that I tell them. For example, I changed the cabinet door codes here to one, two, three, because I thought that was easy enough to remember, but they still forgot. <laughs> I don't understand why HR can't get me better people. I'm requesting full authority to hire and fire my own employees. It's the only way I can run my department smoothly. End of log. Oh my god. Some dude, I'm reading the email about like how one of the people can't, uh, they uh, can't remember the code, and I'm listening to the audio recording, right? <laughs> and he's in there like, I changed the code, or they can't remember the simplest things. I changed the code to one, two, dang it. I changed the code to one, two, three, because I thought that'd be simple enough for them to re remember, but they can't even remember that. Hey! I was talking to you! Ah, that lets you know when it's ready to close. I see. Okay. Is there something else out here that wants to fight me right now? Toxic gas levels decreased 50%. I mentioned I really hate claw machines. Have I ever told you that, Hunter? What, sorry? How much I hate claw machines. Um. You don't really have to say, uh, because I understand. I was surprised. So, <laughs> I've only won one thing. I screamed at it. I was screaming at it when I was playing it in Yakuza, in the Yakuza games in general. Toxic gas is cleared. Yep, Waste that's disposal fair. area now safe for entry. All right, I've got to pick up the pace. Got more men down. Bravo team is barely holding their own. You know what? Why don't I get rid of the other barrels just for safety procedures? Let's go ahead and close this and pick up this barrel. Let's transfer the item to the incinerator. What do you say, Hunter? Hunter? Oh, there's 
like usual, I'm all alone. What are you doing? Moving back to the- Oh! Didn't mean it. George, it has come to my attention yet again that you did not show up, to your sh uh, show up for your shift on Wednesday. This is the fourth time this month that you have missed the shift. I'm getting tired of your pathetic excuses. You had two prostate exams last month, and I will not uh, fall for that excuse again. Consider yourself on notice, Mr. Buddha. Tired of your boss getting you down? Do you want to make your own hours? Looking for a chance to double or even triple your income? Well, here's the big opportunity. It's as easy as logging on to www.martianbuddy.com. Come find out uh, how easy it is to work from home, uh, making a big dollar, 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 dollar. Well, I appreciate it, but what, what was the point? Cargo removal. Was that the point of it? Was cargo removal? Whatever. Ow! The quicker draw. Wait, where am I supposed to go? Oh, yeah, scan the access card. Two pistol shots. That's not very nice. I need assistance. I need you out of the way. Okay, you seriously need to stop.
Yeah, no, I'm not trusting that. This is where I'm supposed to go, I see. That's fine, I'll head this way. I missed a lot of shots there. That doesn't sound good. Let's head down to the lower left. Cigar. Yes. I am back. Welcome back. Go back. Wait, what am I stuck on? That's not very nice. That wasn't a kill. I don't know. You know what, Hunter? I'm taking back what I said about the shotgun. It might not have range, but it lacks in range. Oh boy, does it kill when something gets close or is big. Or is big. <laughs> or is big. Why are you here? I'm assuming these are pinkies. Well, well, they're not pink, but they have the same kind of the big shape and everything and the big mouth, you know what I mean? That's an amp. Something burst through the window. I burst through the window. I don't remember what the what the lab or what the Oh, I didn't see a PDA thing. Is it one two three still? It's still one two three over here! Easy to remember. Were you here for that conversation? Yes. I love that so much. <laughs> I'm doing better about checking my chat now. Yes. You've been talking in there? No. But I'm gonna die looking at it, I swear. Yeah, 
You know, why aren't they waiting for me? Instead of continuously moving forward. I'm gonna make a save before I do this. Hey, Honor. There's a scientist in a chamber. Activate chamber or open the chamber. Hunter. Um, I said activate. Activate. I think it just crushed him. Oh no, it incinerated him. And I'm getting attacked by uh, soldiers now. I'm gonna assume that's for killing him. I mean, what was I supposed to do? He said, he said, open the chamber or open up the chamber. So I hit activate. I didn't know what button. Thank you. Button blind. <laughs> yeah, you get attacked. Green button to open it. Oh, red. Okay. You push the red. Yeah, I know. You said push the red button. Said push the green. <laughs> Thanks for getting me out of there. I got trapped in the chamber when the power went out. I don't know what's going on here. I don't understand okay. why none of the systems are responding. I'm going to try to get an uplink into the main system from here. This is a secure terminal. I might be able to get a connection. I'm going to stay here. Can lock the door after you leave. I yeah, but think I'll be safe. That's a lot more. Well, could you open up the guns over here? There's like a lot of armaments that I could have. What? No, no, no. You have to put the song name, title. Security log number whatever. 3072 for Delta Security yeah, Chief Michael Abrams, November 15th. Two one four five. I can't put that in three. I've just come lot. from the armament division where I was issued one of the new BFG nine thousand series a weapons. <laughs> well, they weren't kidding about how much lighter it is over previous prototype yeah. models. Won't be so bad carrying this one around. <laughs> Anyhow, for a couple of weeks now, many of the security teams have not been following proper reporting procedures. Not sure if it's the format of the new SIR, so I'll make sure each team is scheduled by training division to get spun up on the new reports. There have been some security issues in the Alpha Labs. I sent a team over to investigate, and now I can't reach them on any comm channel. Guess I'll have to go over there myself. Well, I'm headed over there now. I'll finish the security report in full when I get back. Oh yeah, one more thing. I'm gonna leave this BFG locked in my office for now. Please have IT security change my door code to 901. Sure so don't need anyone messing around with it. Chief Abrams, end of log. Okay. Hunter, remember 931 for me. Otherwise, I won't remember. In a quest to provide armies with a well-balanced set of weapons, UAC looked to the past when designing and manufacturing the newest line of Mach 2 chain guns. The retro style and mechanical sturdiness of the chain gun is a must for all hardened combat veterans. Early adapters have nicknamed it Saw. With its armor-piercing 30 caliber bullets, the chain gun is capable of literally cutting opponents in two. Packed with all the punch you need in close combat fighting, the chain gun delivers unparalleled reliability and functionality. Always on the forefront of technology, the UAC is making safer worlds through superior firepower. So I guess 600 is the maximum amount of ammo for it. Hey, what? Minigun. Yep. Oh, I could just say grenades. <laughs> no, I have 50 for that. Uh, is that is that maxed out? Or? I don't know. But I do know that... I, oh, rude! I am getting bullied by one dude. Oh, it's only the spider things. 
You don't All scare right. me. I was actually pretty stoked to play Warfare 2. <laughs> to play what? Modern Warfare 2 remastered. Yeah. Gunfire! Gunfire! Honey, there's a lot of kinky people here. Just stating that. Ow! 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 No, I was hoping to get in close enough before he could pull the trigger. Not creepy at all. Christ. So you have six hundred and sixty ammo for the chain gun. Marine, great schematic oh, show really all missed out of your area. Yeah. Lots of missed opportunity. The only way through is by traversing the EFR. Mechanical subsystem with two possible. Oh, I see. Activating the system yeah, will get you a direct route to the danger. <laughs> Extending the service bridges is safer, but the lighting systems are fried. Make a choice, Marine. Good luck. Oh, I wasn't. I, d I died from fall damage because I failed to use the ladder. The only way through is by traversing the EFR. Mechanical subsystem with two possible routes to it. Activating the system will get you a direct route, but it's dangerous. Extending the service bridges is safer, but the lighting systems are fried. Make a choice, Marine. Good luck. Okay, Hunter, since you're the only one here... What do you think? Extend the service bridge? For... Uh, extend the service bridge? Or take the more direct route? But it's more dangerous. Um, well, I wonder which one is it? Service. Service? Oh yeah, I forgot to mention, the lights are out on the service elevator. Is that still your decision? No, doesn't change it. Doesn't... Wait, what? So... That's still your decision or no? Yes. Take the longer route then. Yes. Possible chance of getting more ammo. I have max ammo. And kill people. Okay. Go ahead and overwrite the save here. Um, service bridge it is. Ow! Why? I just got assaulted from behind while I was paying attention to the bridge. This area doesn't seem much safer. over in the not so safe area. All I would have had to done is a little bit more parkour. They are sending me with a bunch of gun people and that's the problem. I need to switch to my shotgun. Okay, if they could stop wait. No, rude, rude, rude! I forgot that doesn't pause! I might die. I died. <laughs> See, I told you, James, I'm bad at games. 
just come back calm This is the audio it. log of plant manager Henry Nelson, dated October 24, 2145. I don't know how I should report this, so I'll just talk about what I know and what I need. I've had quite a few employees reporting to me that they've heard strange sounds, like voices talking to them, calling them, even when they were alone. At first, I didn't believe them. The guys down here like to kid around, but they assured me they were serious. I ignored the stories at first, until one day, I heard something too. I was working on one of the lift-up service panels, and I distinctly heard the voice of someone saying, over here, I quickly oh, I turned to see who was that. there, but the passage was completely empty. I looked around, but I didn't see another soul. I even checked the work logs, and no one else was working near that area. I don't want to sound crazy here, but my guys and myself are a little spooked, and some of the guys are even talking about ghosts. So, to make everyone, including myself, feel a little more comfortable, I'd like to request that a security team make a thorough check of the EFR area. Thank you. Henry Nelson. working out for me, Hunter. Why did you choose that way back, Dingus? Well I, ex well, I chose the other way the second time and I failed a platforming part and fell to my death. Also, it was your decision. Why would you listen to me? Because you're better at games than me. <laughs> That's a good joke. <laughs> okay, start the EFR process. Let's whip out the shotgun and give him a good taste of 12 gauge in the mouth. Well, I can guarantee you one thing, Hunter. You know what that is? What's that? We're not using uh, slugs. Yeah. Okay, you need to die. Oh, rude. <laughs> Why are you still alive? Okay. Sure. Take care of that. Honor, I'm getting shot up. You could not you could not possibly understand how much it sucks to get shot up by these guys while you're trying to focus on not getting hit by the close quarter dudes. I mean I've played that game before, yeah. Have you? Yeah. You know, I want my plasma rifle and my BFG already. <laughs> hey! I feel like I'm getting violated here. You know why it's called the BFG, right? Because it's the big friendly gun. Yes, friendly. But the new dude's gonna have like a unicorn gun. They already have Doomicorn. Am I gonna have to jump this one? I don't really feel safe going down this path, you know that? Can you bring me closer? I don't want to make that jump if I don't have to. Ow! I didn't 
know you could lunge so far. I'm running on more platforms. I don't think this was meant for use for travel. No, stop! Did James say something? Sound that she came from his mic. Uh, who's approaching me from behind? Kaya! You're still alive? I think his bullets answered that for me. <laughs> oh, you! You are mean! Oh, I just got a witness of the BFG! What's that? Huh? What? I said, what was that? I just got a. I just got to witness the use of the BFG. Now I didn't get to experience it myself yet. One, two, three, four. Should get me nice and healed up. I might want to use it another time, to be perfectly honest. Chucking explosives or anything? I can't avoid the spikes being thrown my way. Ah, she has telekinetic power. She has telekinetic powers. I cannot survive this gauntlet. You are getting. Okay, Hunter. I've been holding on to my grenades now for a while. I think, I cannot skip this cutscene, but I think it is time to throw grenades at the giant spider lady. I've been waiting. Giant spider lady. Explosives weren't the option. They they did not work how I thought they would. So you know what time it is? Hunter? What what time is it? It's time to use the minigun! Or the chain gun. My bad, it's called the chain gun. I have to reload! Well, 
the chain gun sound like Frider. Sims 4, James? Bravo team, entry secure. Move in and take positions. Watch out. All quiet. Did you hear that? Five minutes. Oh, this is Lee. Give me status. Oh, uh, clear. There's nothing here, Sam. I, I think I what the hell? All personnel evacuate the facility. Warning. Well, wasn't close enough to do. What killed me? Chief, I just took like 300 damage. And I gotta watch this again. All quiet. Did you hear that? Oh, this is Lee. Give me status. Always clear. There's nothing here, Sam. Just so that way I don't have to deal with that again. Warning. Coolant rod 2 offline. Main reactor operation temperature exceeding safe levels. Marine, Bravo team is down. Their operational status is unknown. They were carrying a military transmission card. It's vital you retrieve that card as it contains encoded data needed to send the distress signal to the fleet. Your last hope to get reinforcements. Find that card and find it fast. Did somebody open my door? Yes. Did you all hear somebody talk? No. So they opened the door and walked out. You know that's not the first time, but that's gotten me killed in VR or in, in Beat Saber before. Yeah, because I went to because I went to go adjust the headset so I could hear them properly, and then I lost. I still don't know what killed me. There's a barrel that close to me. Come on, demon, why are you running away?
But you are blocking me off. Oh yeah, I just got a plasma gun. I also cannot move because the bot jumped in front of me. What hit me there the second time? Now, Hunter, I'm not sure what they were thinking. I remapped one of the controls because left control was the same button as shoot. As left click. What? Yeah, I know. What were they thinking? I know. What? It does not make sense to me, Hunter. Is there another... Are you done being annoying? Clearly not. Me and the sentry bot are wiping the floor with you all. Main reactor operation temperature exceeding safe levels. I don't want to save over that. Cancel, please. Coolant rod 2 offline. Main reactor operation temperature exceeding safe levels. What? Where am I supposed to go? Did I hear a woman crying? Is that what I was hearing? You know, I don't even think I've seen a woman on this ship. Yes. Well, that's pleasant. Ow! Service bridge now operational. First woman I see on the ship and I get attacked by a floating head from her. This is the audio log of weapon analyst Teresa Chazar, dated November 3rd, 2145. I'm pleased to report that the preliminary tests on the ammo storage in the new Mach 3 plasma gun has far exceeded our expectations. We realized a full 50% gain in the storage capacity of ammo packs as a result of utilizing techniques engineered in the Alpha Lab's molecular compactor. I believe with the ongoing compaction research, we will reach our goal of three times the plasma storage currently available in standard ammo packs. I would also like to mention that all of the employees here at the NPRO plant have been very helpful and quite eager to accommodate all of my requests. For security reasons, I've locked the plasma gun and the extra ammo in locker 063 with door code 972. End of lock. Wait, wait. I missed what... I missed the, uh, code. This is the audio log of weapon analyst I'd Teresa like Chazar, there. dated November 3rd, 2145. I'm pleased to report that the preliminary tests on the ammo storage in the new Mach 3 plasma gun has far exceeded our expectations. We realized a full 50% gain in the storage capacity of ammo packs as a result of utilizing techniques engineered in the Alpha Lab's molecular compactor. I believe with the ongoing compaction research, we will reach our goal of three times the plasma storage currently available in standard ammo packs. I would also like to mention that all of the employees here at the NPRO plant have been James very helpful Arcana? and quite eager to accommodate all of my requests. For security reasons, I've locked the plasma gun and the extra ammo in locker 063 with door code 972. 972. End of lock. Okay. No, really, is that James or is that Keenan? take so much damage from that attack. I knew I wanted head, but not like that. Ha! Ah. Am I funny yet? Wow. 
Well, am I Hunter and or James? Hazard doors sealed. Please contact plant management for immediate assistance. Warning, reactor core temperature 235 degrees Celsius. That's very close. That's not very nice. Scientist, but isn't 585 degrees Celsius like gonna kill me? Warning, reactor core temperature beyond acceptable levels. I am in just say transmission card. If Swan gets his hands on it, I don't know why he'll just be there. That's it. Nothing more. What was that? It'll be just a bit warm. Nothing more. Okay. That makes me feel a little bit better. How much ammo does that carry? 550. Warning. Reactor core temperature 900 degrees Celsius. Now, Hunter! Mm. Is 900 degrees Celsius good enough for my hot tub? Yeah, could be a bit more. But, uh, I'm yeah, replacing. I'm replacing rod 2. James, are you okay? That was very distant. They're very distant. That was really uncertain. Do you I see the car? No, sir. Okay, let's get to the communications facility. We can stop the transmission from there. Whatever you say, counselor. Okay, now it's a nice and cold 189 degrees Celsius. Dude, I'm not a fan of the plasma gun. The gun fire on it is so slow.
this is a very long elevator, and if it's one thing that any form of horror game has taught me, even at games with only minor horror, it's that going up or down a really long elevator shaft usually ends poorly. Yeah. All right. I'm just saying. And they didn't do it. They subverted the trope. Okay, James. I can't. That's the only thing I can hear from James is just whatever weird thing he ends up doing. Yeah. Nothing more. Just waiting for you to re emerge. Oh! I don't know why that scared me, but it did. Waiting for me to kill you, huh? Did James put you in timeout? I was hoping James. Wow, my aim. I was hoping James would respond to that one. made me question this recently. You know when you have a really big bullet sponge boss? I don't remember the name of the video, by the way. Uh, but, uh, so, do you ever, whenever you have a very big bullet sponge enemy, do you ever think about if they really died from the bullets, or if they maybe just died from the sheer weight of all the bullets you put in them? Don't start doing that to me. Huh? Don't start doing that to me. What do you mean? Because that's a good... <laughs> that's a good question? Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad you think so. Because when I saw the video, I was thinking like, I never thought about that before, but some of those enemies have so many bullets in them, they must be feeling the weight of it at some point, you know what I mean? Yeah. my PDA. 
Rad. Paul Rad, Chief Technical Officer for the NPro facility. During my weekly inspection of the coolant system, I discovered... This is the audio log of weapon analyst Teresa... Paul Rad, Chief Technical Officer for the NPro facility. During my weekly inspection of the coolant system, I discovered yet another safety violation. As I've stated repeatedly, our service manuals must be followed to the letter. Now, this includes changing back filters for the coolant system on schedule and not when maintenance gets around to it. As you know, unclean back filters will create uh. pressure inside the coolant system's release tubes. Even a minor disruption in a release tube can dislodge or destroy its coolant rod, overheating the core, possibly sending the entire facility up in smoke. Now, let me be clear. If I see this again, the team responsible will be transferred to sewage treatment before the day is over. Security log number 3072 for Delta Security Chief Michael Abrams, November 15th, 2145. I've just come from the armament division where I was issued one of the new BFG 9000 series weapons. <laughs> well, they weren't kidding about how much lighter it is over previous prototype models. Won't be so bad carrying this one around. <laughs> Anyhow, for a couple of weeks now, many of the security teams have not been following proper reporting procedures. Not sure if it's the format of the new SIR, so... I'll make sure each team is scheduled by training division to get spun up on the new reports. There have been some security issues in the Alpha Labs. I've sent a team over to investigate, and now I can't reach them on any comm channel. Guess I'll have to go over there myself. Oh, wait, well, I'm headed over there now. I'll finish the security report in full when I get back. Oh, yeah, one more thing. I'm gonna leave this BFG locked in my office for now. Please have IT security change my door code to 901. Sure as hell don't need anyone messing around with it. Okay. Chief Abrams, and the law. Paul Rad, Chief Technical Officer for the NPro facility. I appreciate UAC's concerns following the number of stress-related illnesses spreading throughout the base. However, I don't understand why we require such a large detail of armed security bots in Enpro. Now, you may disagree, but I trust my team's mental condition far more than whatever programming is running inside those bots. Which brings me to the reason for this report. Today, one of my best engineers, Patrick Thomas, was nearly shot when a bot refused his clearance. That's right, shot. Luckily, a nearby team from maintenance caught up to it and smashed it with a pipe wrench before it could chase Pat down. Now, it'll be days before he's ready to return to work, and I don't think you'll ever get him close to one of those bots again. Our jobs are difficult enough without needing to avoid getting shot. If we're going to be treated like prisoners, I respectfully request that you afford us the courtesy of being guarded by people instead of machines. Come on, you guys. If you're too selfish to waste 10 to 15 minutes in school, uh, in school and there's a forwarding it to everyone, just think it uh, could be a rest day and it's not even your credit. Uh, just do time. Please help this little girl out, guys. You can do it. I love you guys. Okay. Back to uh, the. Steve Hammer, load. service technician. Uh, Since the, Private Swenson wigged out, and shot up that drink machine, then lit himself up with a plasma gun, we've all been a bit nervous. All of us in maintenance knew he was losing it. Finally, when that darn drink machine wouldn't accept his credits, he lost it. Started swearing up and down, and you had to laugh when that machine lit up. But before any of us could react, he fed himself enough plasma to power an office building. There wasn't enough head to clean up. Just vapor. It's a bad thing to happen to anyone. Anyway, I know with all the psych problems we've had lately, we need the additional security. But when the guards start going nuts, I don't know, all this extra weapons and ammunition. I mean, do we really need so much firepower laying around? Well, a couple of us decided to lock up all of the unsecured plasma rounds we could find. The code is 734. I think we'll all sleep a bit better tonight knowing it's locked up. Somebody decided to stay in there. Haul up with all the guns. That's a lot of, that's a lot of plasma rounds, but I'm not using the plasma gun that much. I don't like it. Why is that? Because it shoots so slow. Like the bullets itself are so slow. They're super slow projectiles. Yeah, that's fair. I don't know how much farther I can go. Here, take the transmission card. We can't stay here. It isn't safe. We better move.
really? I finally met up with Bravo Team, and they're dead! Look, I'm not asking for much. I'm just asking for my other team to be able to, I don't know, survive long enough to make it to them. Is that too much to ask, Hunter? Yeah. Why am I, a single man, able to do it and they can't? Yep, yeah, see, that's, that's the... That's the what? That's, that's a really good question. It doesn't make any... Yeah. It doesn't make sense to me. It's broke. Come on, man. You're all soldiers, I'm a soldier too. Are you supposed to be the cockademon? Because you certainly look weird. Attacked on all angles here. There we go, that was a nice meaty shot. Well, just to make sure. Sorry, say that one more time. I said, hey, don't go breaking stuff. Oh, I'm not breaking, well, I'm breaking skulls. Look, I've made a habit to make sure things are dead in any game that has any mechanic of the dead are a lot, or coming back, you know what I mean? Yeah. And I'll if there's- Shoot an enemy that's still on the ground. Yeah, if there's, if there's, so, if there's somebody laying on the ground, friend or foe, I just give him a solid thwap with my fist. It looks like we managed to get a refile, so that's the plus. Data storage is important, you know? Yeah. Don't spook me like that. I'm running low on oxygen already. And I don't quite know where to go! I'm moving. I don't have time to mess with you all. Oh wow. Oh wow. Oh, wow. You know, maybe standing underneath the elevator was a bad idea. <laughs> you know what I mean? I do not... If that's the cockademon, I really don't like the design for it. Get your ass. 
pass to the communications facility as quickly as possible. Gotta get that message to the fleet. Oh, how did you get behind me? Thought I was being observant. Clearly not, though. Turn it while I'm reloading. You can't wait until after I've finished reloading. Oh. Who wants to catch these hands? Because you're not going to, you're going to catch bullets instead. Let me know what you don't do. Do this. No, none of the enemies in Doom are catching my hands. Odds are they'll hit me back. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> you know what? There's a free shotgun here. There we go, just eradicate the corpse. What was that? Probably just about, I said I'm gonna head out. Uh, okay. Dinner's probably just about ready. Okay. Okay, see ya, Hunter. Yep, see ya, man. Can I, like... Okay. Really, that hurt. Barely even a fall. Oh, you're still alive. That's right, I have a chainsaw now.
That was very close. Still managed to hit me. Now I'm not exactly sure what's causing that sudden foul noise. You're not very nice, you know that? But it's not like I was really asking you. Okay, so falling in that is death. Good to know, I suppose. Okay, that's fine. That's not so fine. Uh, Ron Ridge, huh? 
This is the audio log of Officer Ron Ridge, dated October 16, 2145. Recent transport tunnel accidents are causing major headaches for both supply and maintenance. Each accident causes an estimated one to three hour delay in one or mostly time sensitive shipments. It's becoming evident that certain junctions need safety adjustments as well as recommitment to driving safety by all personnel. The MPRO to Com Center route has shown the biggest increase in accidents over the past six months. Safety signs and approved lighting are needed throughout the main junctions over the stretch of tunnels and paths. Absolutely, no recreational vehicle passage should be allowed during peak hours. All personnel should use monorail travel whenever possible to keep cargo shipments flowing smoothly. Okay. Well, I just kind of ran around through here. Service lift called to station. Kind of dark, don't you think? I suppose he did say they did need lighting upgrades. This is definitely a save moment. So it is possible to shoot their stuff. I'm supposed to get back up. Gosh darn it. That's not very nice. I'm about to get beat up. Where's this one go? Oh, that's nice. Maintenance exit now accessible. Okay. That worked excessively well. Save it. 
I should be able to make it there. Oh, I see where I am. Okay, I managed to not take damage. For some reason, I was expecting a monstrosity or something to attack me. What's this? What is that? Berserk! You wanna mess with me? You, you don't. Come transfer. Marine, are you at the communications facility yet? You gotta get that message to the fleet now. Watch out for Campbell and Swan. Those UAC suits don't give a damn about what happens to any of them. down the pit. There's maintenance and communication.
easy enough to learn it. Okay. Okay. Power fluctuations in main communications router 48A6. Attempting insulation from the router. That worked out still. Communication really? system overload. Communications shut down. Really? That's how we're playing. Now you have shields. Oh. Where from? Marine. Delta system computers are showing all off base communication down. It's that cool swan. You're gonna have to find another way to send that message. Make your way to the satellite room and manually establish a link from there. Base schematics are showing the quickest way through engineering. Can't fail, movie. Get that message. access that. Oh well. Oh, I need the one I was sure it would give me. Wait, I don't exactly know what I'm supposed to be doing now. engineering transfer bay is locked that area is secure Engineering. Wait, who has the right? Okay. Unable to transmit message. Let's check what he has to say. This is the audio log of technician Seamus, dated October 16th, 2145. Our relatively new remote module replacement procedures are taking some time for maintenance technicians to adjust to. In the long run, it's a much safer, quicker, and easier method. Once a technician receives a call, he simply locates the problem module and gives a replacement command through the remote terminal located in the main comm block. This will initiate the replacement procedure as well as create a repair report, which notifies the repair team of an incoming module. Some minor repairs can be done on site with normal equipment. I'm hoping the new system will need less and less use once the source of the recent power fluctuations is located and solved. The system is built to handle most other things with its automated recovery system. Hmm. 
about to say that's a bit of a drop. You got turned around from your attack. I am very lucky right now. I was very lucky. Okay, that got rid of all of them. Ow! Oh, can't imagine being skewered by that. You think you can scare me like that? That's right, I'll go ahead and see what's in there. Yeah, so scary. You're a bit more of a problem. That can't be good. Okay. Okay. They're one of those dudes that are carrying the shields. Did I ever mention I'm not a fan of you all? This is the uh, audio log of Officer Ben Wolf dated October 7th, 2145. <clears throat> Recent uh, unauthorized transmissions have been uncovered in the off-site redundant logs. These logs are usually not valid, Oops. but uh, an unscheduled audit has shown significant activity. More investigating will be done to get to the bottom of this matter. Particularly interesting are transmission blocks D4560. DE-3288, which have no link to the base systems. More to follow. Sounds like somebody didn't use a VPN. 
Marine, I believe the source of the invasion was from the main portal here in Delta. After you send that transmission, get here as quickly as possible. Oh wait, is there a security code somewhere here? I don't know what this one could be. Oh well. Unless I'm missing a log here. Oh wait, 246. I didn't register that. You give me a second. I took that one to the face. Okay. Can I like go all the way back for health? Cause I'm feeling like I might need a little bit more. Satellite control. Marine, computer system shows Swan and Campbell are still in the area. Watch out for them. And get that transmission sent. How about we save? Nice PDA from Rob Finch. Oh, no, no audio logs. Quiz night. Finchy, don't forget that trivia quiz night is this Wednesday. 
Do yourself a favor and brush up on the Shakespeare, on the Shakespeare, mate. If we lose to those twits in administration again, we'll never hear the end of it, Brent. Hey, bro, mom told me you were headed home in a week or so. They can't wait for that, can ya? I've been pretty busy down here. Little Annie is almost nine now. Can you believe that? Diane and I are thinking about another one soon. We're gonna have to move into a double wide orbiter. Anyway, I wouldn't keep you. Or anyway, I won't keep you. Sorry. See you soon, Flapper. Okay, they're dead. Confirm. Satellite control, huh? Manual uplink established. Green, you hear me? Back off yeah. from that console. Do not call for reinforcements. We don't know what the hell is going on here. And until we do, this area remains under UAC control. Cancel that transmission. Satellite connection established. Another thing here. How about we decide to transmit? You fool. You have no idea what you just did. If the creatures get hold of those ships, who knows what could happen? You might have endangered all of Earth. I'm going to Delta to stop this. Don't get my Transmission way. successful. Excellent, Excellent work, Marine. Wait. Do I really want to do that? Transmission terminated. We did the right thing. Until we know what's happening here, we need to keep ourselves sealed off from everyone else. The monorail entrance looks clear. Meet up with us there. We need to reach the Delta Complex and stop this. You know what? I'll decide this at a later time. For now, I'm going to end the stream here. So I will see you all next time. Bye.